this video touched me because I'm an essential worker for one, plus I'm a, a black woman. I'm being exposed to this every day or not knowing who I'm exposed to. Um, even though she had a breakdown, I understand why, because it's affecting us as a black community. It's also, it's just scary right now. Stay out in about 12 days. I'm on my way to Whole Foods to get some important essentials that we need. And I don't know, for some reason today, I've just been overcome with such emotion. I just want all of us to get through this and to the other side. And especially within our black communities where people are sick and dying. So many of us are dying. And they can't, we can't put food on the table for our children. We can't pay our rent. We can't pay our mortgages. Um, you know, I had pretty much been holding it, you know, together. I would have my moments, but uh, had things that kept me, you know, pretty much distracted and I was okay. And actually... I'm a Virgo, which is a nurturer, and I'm actually a, a real homebody. So for me, it was not so much about the fact that I couldn't go out and stay home. It was about going out. And on that particular day, um, I, I, just, I just realized that I had been watching the news like 24-7, and I thought, you know, it was really starting to get to me. And I said, you know, let me just back off of this just a bit. And as I said in the video, I was on my way out to Whole Foods to get some necessities. And my husband happened to be watching the news. And I saw where they were reopening the state of Georgia. And in the city of Atlanta, I saw all of these people of color going into malls, no face mask, right. going into nail and hair salons. And we are getting this disease and dying at such an alarming rate. I said, what are these people, what are these people doing? And I, was, I just became mm -hmm. so overwhelmed because the thing about it, Tamron, I wasn't, all of these other things started flooding my head at the same time. Right. I'm looking at people of color and I'm thinking about all that we have gone through as an you know, as African American uh, community, going through slavery, going through J Jim Crow, not being able, only being able to drink at colored water fountains, not being able to to vote. Now you know, mothers being afraid whenever their sons step out of the front door, are they going to come back, you know, alive or shot down just because of the color of their skin? And all of these things started coming at me, and I thought, we as a people, I just felt exhausted, exhausted, and, and a sense of loss, feeling lost, and, and I just had a meltdown. 